when you guys see this is just <laughs> sorry <laughs> what the f hey what's up i'm troy sivan and i'm going to be painting attempting to paint a self-portrait of myself while you get to know a little bit more about me first of all i feel like i need to give a disclaimer i I'm so bad at this, <laughs> like <laughs> really, really genuinely awful. Like I like to consider myself a creative in most ways, but like I've absolutely no clue what <laughs> is going on. I would say it's like maybe one of the party ones, maybe a, um, <laughs> sorry, um, the eggplant emoji and also the heart emoji. The best gift I've ever received. Oh. I got taken on a camping trip with um, my friends and um, my ex-boyfriend for my birthday one year and it was like literally the best weekend of my life. The worst, one time my parents didn't know what to get me for my birthday and my dad thought it was funny for some reason to give me car mats like for your feet but I don't have a car. I, I, I think, I don't know why he, he did that. He said it was because he couldn't think of what to get me. He was like, I know something he doesn't have car mats because he doesn't have a car. But I thought for a split second, I was like, oh my God, dad, you got me a car? <laughs> like I was so excited. And then he realized what an awful thing he had done. Um, so that's probably the worst. <laughs> Just, sorry, the progress that I've made is <laughs> nil. Um, doing choreo for the first time is really, really scary, but it has been something that I've like wanted to do <laughs> for my whole life, I think. And always been <laughs> sorry um always been really really scared of because i don't know i just sort of have always like told myself <laughs> that i couldn't dance um it's like part of the narrative that i've just like kind of told myself so doing it for the first time was just really really <laughs> <laughs> sorry <laughs> I feel stuck. Like I, I actually feel trapped. Um, maybe, yeah. If I can, if I can do it. I, I've never had to sing while dancing before, so I really have no idea if I can. But I'm gonna definitely give it a good go. I guess my goal is to just like rehearse like insanely, like so much, and and see if I can do it. Cause it would be really, really fun. That's yeah, that's the dream. I don't really get nervous about being naked. Like I used to. I think. I think I've been on like a really big journey with my body image and kind of stopped caring and I think I also just realized that like this is my body and it it works and I'm grateful for that and um I you know just kind of started to feel hot yeah the secret to a great thirst trap pick I reckon show just enough actually you know what think about what just enough is push it like two percent and then that is the right amount I have no idea. If I knew that, I would have a boyfriend. <laughs> yeah, sorry. I think I believe in like multiple soulmates. Yeah, I think so. I'm gonna color in my skin, I think. I think that's a good way to waste some time. <laughs> Oof. Honestly, I know this sucks, but accept that it sucks. Like, it just does. It absolutely sucks. And I think once you kind of like free yourself of the idea of trying to get through it and get better and what and like when is this going to end and whatever it's not going to end it's just going to kind of like slowly but surely you're going to learn to sort of live with it and be okay by yourself and it's actually like a really really beautiful journey i think you know and or at least it can be just accept that it's going to be really shit for a while what is the sexiest lyric on the album there's a lot i think in rush when i say kiss it when you're done I think that's, that's a hot one. Um, I think probably all of the lyrics on Still Got It. It tells like a really sort of linear story that I think you can follow along and that makes me really proud as a songwriter. We should experiment even to the detriment of whoever's on the couch. Mm -hmm, for sure, yeah. I definitely have that moment where I kind of like need to remind myself that there's other people around at like a party or something like that when you meet someone that you are really into. I mean, I love like a dance floor makeout or whatever and it's easy to get carried away and then you realize that there's like hundreds of people around you. Um, I definitely, I mean that was me shooting my shot. Yeah and I mean we've like, we, we've messaged, he's very nice, it didn't work is the answer but he's a really nice guy. I don't know, we'll see. Yeah I have no idea, maybe Ross Lynch. 
I do, yeah. I think I get starstruck by、um, like people's work. You know what I mean? Like regardless of. Of how like commercially successful, or even what industry really. Like I think the most nervous that I've been in a long time was I bumped into an interior designer that I absolutely love at a hotel that she designed that I was staying at because it's like my favorite hotel in the world. And I saw her and I just went up to her and told her how much I love the hotel. And I honestly don't think she like appreciated it that much. So I just was like kind of nervous and it was weird. A, a rub list, like a. a Areas are so hard that you would want to rub. There's this designer Pamela Shamshiri、um, that I I would steal everything from.、Yeah. I genuinely think that we have the best coffee in the world. I love the pace. I, you know, I think we're really good about taking time off and not like living、uh, to work, but working to live. And the last thing,、um, maybe Vegemite. Most Australian thing about me, besides the fact that I'm Australian, maybe that I really like Vegemite. Yeah. Toxic by Britney Spears.、Um, I think about that song so much. I, I just think it's like actually genius, like one of the best songs ever. The, the, everything about it. I think the production still sounds fresh, and it's like what, 15 years later or something. And 20 years. Wait, really? Wow. So the other day I was at the Loewe show in Paris, and I was talking to Charlie XCX, and then we bumped into Robin. And I was like, "Damn, I need to take a photo of this moment." So I, I got a selfie with the both of them, and I supported Robin on tour a couple years ago. And Charlie and I have obviously worked together so many times; we're like really good mates. And I would love to know what would come out of that pop session. As a trio, what would you be called? Maybe Pop Three. My top three Janet Jackson songs. I would say "All Night," "Together Again," and maybe "Slow Love." Maybe. Very true. If you want to like add any like. Oh, sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> totally forgot about. Um, I mean, I just think like he's so unafraid to take up space, like in the sort of culture, and I think that that's really cool. I think sometimes as queer people, it's like I don't know. It just feels like everything you do is like kind of politicized and and feels like some sort of big statement, even if you're just doing literally what everyone else does in music videos. He just seems totally unafraid of all of that, and that's really, really inspiring. Like I, I feel like I've been doing this for a long time, and I've always felt like I needed to just sort of stay in my little lane. You know, I don't think he feels that way, and that's really cool to me. Um, I knew that I wanted a shot of, of me singing through a glory hole, and I kind of pushed through. Honestly, like inspired by the cinematography and like the Toxic video, there was something so like '90s, early 2000s about that shot pushing through the glory hole, and I just thought it was sickening. So、uh, and then the vinyl came afterwards. I, I don't、um, listen to my early music. If I did, I think it would be like、uh, sort of the same as if you were to watch home videos or like read your journal or something from when you were a kid. I would sing、um, Ease. I love that song. Of,、uh, it's featuring Broods from my first album. I don't like telling this story because I don't want to encourage this behavior. But one time, a guy came backstage after the show and was like having beers with the band and myself. And I thought it was my drummer's friend. And my drummer came up to me and he's like, "Who is that guy?" I was like, "I don't know. I thought it was your mate." Turns out he was no one's mate. He just like thought it would be fun to come hang. And it honestly, was <laughs> it was really fun. <laughs> he was really cool. We bumped up security since then. So don't <laughs> don't try any shit. I don't really know. I've never had like a five-year plan or anything like that. I think just like kind of keep doing what feels right and what inspires me in that moment. And I think people can always tell when something is like genuine to you, and that's how you kind of keep growing. I think if you try and plan things out or do the same thing over and over again, it, it gets really boring. It's not really an opinion, but I've never tried like lobster because I'm allergic. Ah,、uh, yeah. Um, nah. Come on. <laughs> probably like sick or sickening. Quality time is probably the biggest one for me. Yeah. Tunnels, driving through tunnels. I don't like them. I get very panicky and shaky and like short of breath. It's fine if I'm a passenger, but when I'm driving, the fact that there's nowhere to pull over if I need to is enough to absolutely send me. I love this photo. I think the thing that I love about it is that it does scare me, and it, it just feels very, very, very real. You said that you used to be self-conscious about smiling in photos. Are you more comfortable now? Not really.、Um, I still think I look a bit like nerdy in the photo, you know. But you know, I think if you were to ask any of my friends, like, is Troy really smiling in this photo? They would be like, 100% yes. That's that's the real deal, and that makes me really proud. Yeah. 
you think you've captured that smile in your painting? I do. <laughs> <laughs> it's done. It's done. You ready? We have my hair, which is the same color as my skin. These are his thighs. This is my very tiny necklace that now takes up most of the frame. Some pink lips, rosy cheeks, eyes and nose. Yes. Cool. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, subscribe to Pop Buzz.